So I have a package and I thought it'd be really nice to unbox it today. So it's time. Chitara looked at me with like great concern when I started using this. I don't like the fact that the cat's calling me out, but here we are. Okay, so for context, this box is from Plaid Crafts. They do a lot of like paint supplies and crafting supplies. And they sent me a little goodie box and I have no idea what's in here. I have a sneaking suspicion, but I don't know what all is in here. So that's what I'm unpitting today. Okay, already there's like so much crap. Just for context, the box is this big. Okay, so first up, some really, really nice brushes. I'm constantly destroying my paint brushes because I wind up using them for glue. So it's really nice to have an enormous amount so that I can destroy them as well. Next is Treasure Gold Folk Art Metallic Luster Water-Based Non-Toxic Paint. It's not like a rub and buff or anything. It just looks like it's a really, really nice quality, like almost gold leaf-esque paint from Folk Art. If you hear crinkle sounds, I'm sorry, the cats have just discovered the paper. Next is, it's like a little, a little box, a little cute box. I don't know what I'll use it for, but this could be really cute to like put something in, like either, oh, I could hang decorations in it. I have a lot of 3D printed, like tiny things. This would be really cool to put in. I don't know where to put it. My desk is already running out of space. Conan, hold on to that for me. Oh. <laughs> it's just a plaque of wood. Is this pine? <laughs> smells like pine. Again, I don't know what I'll use this for, but this could be something really cool. <gasps> Actually, I do know what I'm going to use this for. Ignore that, you'll see it later. This is gonna be fun. Oh, before the paints, there's actually a little thing of Mod Podge. Okay, so first up, it looks like we have a ton of matte style folk art paints. Oh my God, there's a lot of them. That one does not have a label. It's a mystery paint. Paint. We have vintage white, daffodil yellow, festive fuchsia, green whisper, blue hyacinth, fire coral, peach breeze. This is so Georgian. Gotta make more room on my desk. There's too much paint. Watery blue, lemonade, why did I say that so Southern? Anyway, it's lemonade. Nutmeg, Orchid Wisp, Imperial Red, Mango Mambo, Eggplant, Pure Black, Deep Viridian, Thicket. I know they have to come up with names for these, but it is funny, some of the, the names. Papaya Whip. <laughs> Okay, so there are four specialty ones. So the first one is a color shift white flash, gloss metallic acrylic paint. I'm so curious about this one. There is a non matte just paint and it's ash. So I guess it's just like a really, really dark gray. This one is called Glitterific. I guess it's like a paint with glitter mixed into it, but it's called Unicorn. I wish I had something for Jester that I could use with this. And the last one is Dragonfly Glaze Violet Blue Green Shift. And then the best part, a large empty box just for the children. Go forth children, enjoy your box immediately. Thank you Plaid for the true gift that you have given me, which is box. I can't hold them all, but thank you Plaid for all the really, really nice paints. I don't know what I'm going to use them for, but they will get used. Jokes aside though, thank you so much Plaid for sending me all these goodies. I am really excited to get to use these, especially the different color shift ones and the glitter one. And I'm so interested about this like gold. I have some upcoming metallic based projects that I would really like to use this for and some props that I haven't finished yet that will eventually go on the, the thingy back there that y'all haven't seen yet. But thank you so much for that. And also, if you're wondering about the change of the background, there's a video coming on that very soon. I'm so excited. There's some last minute things that need to be finished before I can show you the big reveal. But needless to say, there's some really cool stuff that's been happening. And I've been going a little insane trying to get everything finished in time, but yeah. So thanks so much for watching as always. If you have any questions, leave them down below in the comments and I will see you all next time.